Okie dokie. Pokey. How you doing now? How are you doing? Well, I have one more video that I need to do for you. <sighs> I'm still not through my coffee. I know, I've got on my doggies jacket. I love it. Oh. Do you do like Mr. Rogers and when you get home, take off certain things and put on your little comfortable things? This is my comfortable sweater. Remember, he would take off his sweater and his shoe, his coat and his, his nice shoes, and he would slip on his loafers and put on his sweater. I liked Mr. Rogers. I was going to show you. Oh, I showed you all this in my last video. Um, this was my phone cover. I put it on my phone. This is a um, 6S Plus iPhone. And this is a swarm of Oscar crystals. They're very tightly on there and nothing brings them off. This is really a good phone case. Very reasonably, reasonably priced. Technically under $50 after tax. It's not, but I feel like it's a good one. It, it's got raised sides, so it does protect it. It doesn't cover over the front, of course. But um, I love it. And it comes in this pretty little satin pouch with lace um, edging, and I just think that's such a nice little touch. I just, it's not, it's so not commercial packaging. And then it always comes with extra uh, little glitters in case one does come off, but, and then you could just use one of those um, nail tools to put one on, but I never have had to do it. I think I've had a few come off over the years, but I mean, they last a really long time, so I'm real happy about this. And it matches my purse. I just did a what's in my purse. This is my Prada bag. And it has gold trim because all this gold zippers and everything. And my jacket that I had on earlier had gold zippers on it. And this would just be so perfect in here now. So that's where it's going. Well, it's going to be out for a little while. But there's something I forgot to show you guys. And to be honest with you, I, I did not do my plan with me as soon as I got back from the trip. Because I was so exhausted. And then um, the next night I did some others. But I... I it was too late to do my plan with me, but I'd like to film it. Because um, it's a little more trouble to film it because I've got to unscrew it from there and put it here and have it, you know, look down on the desk and all that. So I wasn't in the mood to do all that. So I just did the, um, I did a plan with me, but I didn't video it. So it's not with me. It's just a plan. But I used L Flowers back when I got it. It's very hard to get hers. I mean, it's really, really difficult, but um, she's starting a new thing where you can get on her rotation, and even that, bless her heart, the only reason it's so hard is because she has such high-quality stickers and has such cute patterns that she designs that it is, she just sells out, and she is really invested. I saw a picture of her room where she's got like, well, like eight to ten printers or cutters or, it's a huge investment to do it at this level, and, um, she just can't keep her orders. I mean, she has so many that she sells out as soon as she put, uploads a video and says, or I think she does it on Instagram now, or she says it in different places, so I get a little confused about that. She used to do it on her prints link, but anyway, in her Instagram, so, and I'm sure it's to feed all her social medias, but, and I get that, but she sells out so fast. It's like people are like, wait, I didn't get it. Well, I got this one. This was her Valentine's um, kit, and I don't remember if it came in a kit or you had to build it. I think you had to build it, which meant you had to get your, um, full boxes, and then you had to get your checklist and your, um, your labels, your, um, header labels, half boxes, and my favorite, the bottom bar washi, which she does, and it fills the whole space, which, that's why I love hers, and then from another kit, um, I used, what is their name? Well, hold on. I did this sidebar, and she's, uh, Elle's even doing some sidebar ones now. Anyway, hers is called Glam Planner, and the other one was called, let's see, I think that was Magnolia Boulevard. Yeah, Magnolia Boulevard was the other. I'll show you it, because I'm probably still going to do a February spread with this one. I didn't use it for this particular um, Valentine's week, but it's really, really cute. That's Magnolia Boulevard. And I don't know her name name. Um, Elle Fowler's um, shop name is The Glam Planner, which I love. And then also from Blackbeard Prints, I used a couple of the decor sheets. But I am going to also um, do a spread with her stickers. And this is the decor sheet 
that I took a lot off for Valentine's Day. You're going to see a lot of it on here. I'll point it out. So that's the the ones that I've used. And then the, the sparkly ones you're going to see, I literally got from a sheet that I got in the dollar section at Target. So this will not be a plan with me. It will just be a plan. Viewing. Ready? It's really pretty. I'm going to hold it a long time so you can see. Isn't that pretty, y'all? Um, okay, so you see the top row is that's the fill boxes. Then right underneath that is the um, checklist, which I really think is so cute. Hers says, do these. And I think, like, one of her subscribers says, why do you put two D put um, do these when you also put on a to-do sticker? Stop. It's cute. And I like to have both. So, anyway... Uh, then she has some extra. She put in this particular, I think this was a kit, come to think of it. Or I don't know, I don't remember. Um, but she had some other option full boxes, which you can put in the third row down, which is what I did. These little um, white background ones. And then I used also from the um, B Magnolia one, I used a few of those every other, like right here and right here. And, um... And then the bottom washi is in that same thing from Glam Planner. And then as you see these little pieces here, especially on Valentine's Day, these little foxes and all the little balloons and things around that day. I think that is actually from um, another place. I think that was from the Blackbeard one. Um, this one that says Happy Valentine's Day. But the rest of these were all from um, Magnolia Boulevard. And um, But the rest of the spreads all glam planner so you guys um feel free to go check all these guys out they have great great quality stickers hers are always glossy i am starting to look more and more at the um at the uh, i'm gonna fold this back so you can maybe look a little more up close at some of it um the matte because it does it's not as reflective on video and also in person it's just a little too shiny and also if you have to pull it up and and reposition it it does kind of show where you made the boo-boos <laughs> more than because it's shiny you know it's like a um, patent leather or something you know it's just a shiny glossy sticker so anyway those of you who look at this some of you are who are not into that and you go why it's just fun it's decorative it's creative i, I really um have a lot to do every day and so when i make my list of things that i'm working on sometimes i use if it gets really detailed i use my little vera bradley is that vera bradley yeah, um, notebook that my boss gave me. It's just a little small one. It's really pretty. It matches the little tote that she gave me. I think that was for Christmas. And uh, when it gets really detailed, then yes, I do have so much to write that I have to use a big page. Actually, whenever I go to meet with any of my bosses, I take that. And then I will take some time to digest what they've told me and make a list of the absolute things I've got to get done either the the certainly the things that must be done that day and then also the important things and the difference is what must be done that day goes in the top this is like a bulletin board and so that's what goes up here so for instance tomorrow morning i have a 9 30 meeting with um um another one of the guys and the team and so that's up there can't miss that and um over here i could not be um late on ordering some flowers for someone who um was having a problem in their family and we sent some um, actually instead of flowers and that is a really great thing y'all because you can pick a price point and um, a level of meal and then they call them and ask them when they would like to deliver it and it's a pre-made meal for them and it just helps out so much more than flowers do so instead of flowers that's a great thing but anyway then once I've had my meetings uh, with with people I will go in here in my to-do list for the day and I add it in here at the non-detail level because it's like that's just my reminder of things that I've got to have done and then usually what goes down here under the littles or little things is what that stands for is things that I'm doing in the evening like that was a dinner date with a bunch of friends from my life um, group which is like a small group Bible study group and we all went to dinner and we all brought our husbands it was really neat we went to do south they got incredible food and then, like yesterday, you know, go see Daddy. That just reminds me when I, sometimes it's good for looking back. It reminds me of when I did things, not things I've got to do. Um, like, look over here. I've got my film plan with me video. 
and I will need to add in and do my Bible study one. I may start doing those on Sunday so I can, I mean Saturday so I can upload them a little earlier on Sunday. So you definitely have them on Sunday night. And then, oops, that one says do these on Sunday and that's actually supposed to have a little prayer thing right there because uh, that's just my prayer list and I need to put some names on there. Um, anyway, and it's just fun. It's creative. I enjoy it. And it's, it's one of those things sort of like people who scrapbook or people who like to cross stitch or people like to knit or they just have a hobby that um, it's productive, but it's, that's not the whole point of it. It's kind of a way to relax. Like people who watch Beth Buchanan videos on a marathon level and they just relax, you know, they just veg out and don't have to do anything. They just let Beth talk and talk and drink coffee, show video stuff. Like that. By the way, I tried to draw the uh, fox. I think I did a good job. Let's see it. Oh, it's next to this girlfriend of mine that I'm writing. Um, I don't want to put her address out there. Let's see if I can fold it over. I'm really proud of my fox. Okay, here it is. What do you think? Isn't it the cutest? I kind of copied another fox that was so cute. But I did freehand that. Isn't it cute? Cute, 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 I'm going to be practicing because I love foxes. Um, Elle sent me a fox with my kit. And it's a pink fox. So it's going to be as long as I, I can make them pull out is the pink fox. I should make my name that. No, it's just Beth Buchanan. The pink fox. I don't know if you can see it good. It's right there. It's a very pale pink, but it's so pretty. It's so cute. I absolutely love her. Love her, love her, love her. I hope you can see her. Um, anyway, so that's all. I need to let you go. So I'll talk to you again soon.